These Synergy front sway bar end links are for those of you that have a 2007 and up JK that are looking for a set of adjustable front sway bar end links for your Jeep that are not going to be a quick disconnect set. Now, Synergy does have some quick disconnect front sway bar end links. There are also a lot of other companies out there that are making some quick disconnects. Those are gonna be generally a little bit more expensive. They have some moving parts, a little bit of additional hardware. If you're not looking for something that's quick disconnect, you just want something adjustable as a sway bar end link, then this is gonna be a great option for you. These ones are gonna be pretty fairly priced. They're gonna install very, very easily. Definitely one out of three wrench installation, probably an hour or less to get them installed. Overall, they're just going to be a good, solid end link. These sway bar end links are designed for those of you that have two to four and a half inches of lift on your JK if you're using the factory sway bar end link mounting locations. If you're changing up that mounting location with one of the brackets that is designed by Synergy, then you can use these on three to six inches of lift. So either way, you're gonna be covered. Most of you aren't running more than four and a half inches of lift on your JK anyway, so you're gonna be just fine with these sway bar end links with the factory mounting locations. Now, as you can see, these are going to be similar to a factory design, however, they are going to be adjustable. What I mean by similar to a factory design is the fact that they have a tie rod end style end up here. This is gonna be the top that actually attaches onto the sway bar. And then you're gonna have a rubber bushing uh, with a crush sleeve on the bottom where it attaches onto the axle side. You have a uh, jam nut here, and these are going to be adjustable, of course, for your different height of lift. Now these aren't going to be uh, quick disconnects like we mentioned before, so they're not going to be greasable. Um, they're not gonna have any of those additional pieces of hardware that come with a set of quick disconnects. So this install is going to be a very simple one out of three wrenches, probably only about an hour to get these installed. The first step is of course removing the factory sway bar end links, and then you can just bolt these directly in their place using the hardware that comes with these, as well as some of your factory hardware. Now, the length of your sway bar end link is going to depend on your lift and how your Jeep is sitting based on the, how much weight is on it. In general, you want your sway bar itself to be parallel to the ground when your suspension is halfway through its travel. So if your Jeep is sitting a little bit lower than halfway when it's just under its own weight, the sway bar is going to be aimed up just a little bit, a few degrees, and that's how most of our Jeeps sit. If you don't wanna go measuring and figuring out exactly where halfway through your travel is, you can just set your sway bar just a little bit higher than parallel to the ground, and you're gonna be good to go. That adjustment isn't going to be completely crucial, so you can eyeball it. These sway bar end links come in at right around $100, and I do think that's gonna be pretty fair for an adjustable set of sway bar end links. These are going to be very well-built sets, so they're not going to wear out on you, they're not gonna bend, break, or otherwise deteriorate. So for $100, I think it's a good buy for a set of adjustable sway bar end links. If you are looking for a set of quick disconnects, those are generally gonna be more expensive, whether you get them from Synergy or one of the other companies out there. Again, because of the additional hardware and the additional moving pieces, but for a set of just straight adjustable end links, I do think these are fairly priced. So if you're looking for a strong and well-built set of adjustable front sway bar end links for your JK, definitely recommend these ones from Synergy, and you can find them right here at extremeterrain.com.